more than I like Chris Letang anyways. Yeah. All right. I agree. So, Six games, is that enough for Zach Ronaldo? No. <laughs> I think Zach Ronaldo's a bum. Like, I mean, he hit he hit Nate McKinnon, and... Uh, it wasn't a dirty hit. It was, no, it was a clean hit. It's yeah. just Nate McKinnon kind of felt it a little bit. Yeah, it looked like he kind of knocked the wind out of him at least. And then, uh, I forget who came over. I think it was the Samuel Gerard, Gerard yeah. the guy that came over from Ottawa. Yeah. And he... over when you go over and approach him, like, I, I feel as though, like... I get it. And we don't know what he said. Obviously, something was said no, there. But when he comes over, he's probably like... He came over with... It looked like the attempt to go, you know... Gave him a little shove. He give wasn't, him, give he him wasn't a shove. Drop, he, he, did, he didn't... If he really wanted to fight Zach Ronaldo... He would have come the gloves, up and... The gloves... Everything would have been, been flying when right away. So, I feel as though, like... I think... I think the six games was deserving. I don't know if it should have been more. I mean, like, yeah, like Zach Ronaldo pretty I much. It, I, I think Zach Ronaldo saw, thought that he was going to come in and fight him, so he just threw his gloves off right away. But, I get it, but then obviously, he, like, Gerard was obviously looking off at the play. Yeah. And got a fist to the face. Yeah. And so, I just, like, Zach Ronaldo is the kind of guy that plays on the edge, if not over the edge. Oh, yeah. And more in the often moment, than not. In the moment, like, and, you, yeah, you have but, zero time to think. You're just like, oh, God, I agree a guy's he has coming zero at time me. to think. <laughs> I agree, but this isn't the first time Ronaldo's. No, that's why. Like, that's why I think play right. Like he is the kind of like he he is the kind of player that Gary Bettman has been trying to weasel out of the of the league. I just yeah, no. Like I feel as though yeah, Zach Ronaldo will be gone within three years, but he. I think you got to give him more than six games. I think I, I thought six was at like, least fair. If if something else happens and. Yeah, give them more. I, don't know. But I just I hate watching that kind of player still in the NHL in a game that they're speeding up the the pace of play. They're going more towards a skilled type of player, and I just think that Zach Ronaldo is still trying to play in the old style yeah. where it's it's kind of gone now. It's just like yeah. there's no need to punch a guy in the face. No, unless you're in there's a no fight. need. Unless you're in a fight, but that wasn't. Unless a fight. you're in a fight, but it wasn't a fight. Wasn't I get that fight. the guy's coming up to you, and you probably expect him to drop the glove, but he, it didn't. It didn't happen. And so I, I know that it's fast paced game, but he had enough time to decide. Okay, no, this guy doesn't want to fight the gloves. I don't know what he said. I don't know no. what Gerard said. Yeah, we, so, we, we don't know what happens on the ice. But, but then the, he hit him. Samuel Gerard came up, and then Ronaldo dropped him. Like yeah, a ton of bricks. So yeah, so I just don't. I think you give him more than six games, and this is like you I, draw a line, saying this is the kind of play that we're trying to get out of the league. Um, Zach Ronaldo, you've had you got a history of yep. suspensions. You got to. You I, I think if it happens again, it, I think it. it I, I think just, if it happens again, like he's not that much of an impact player anyway. So I think six he's games not. Is and it, but it's fine. the same. Even like it's the same kind of thing as Kachuk earlier. Like the player safety is not, in my opinion, is not. Oh no, it's not that taking great. enough initiative to stop. Stop. Well, to things. to deal out consequences that actually matter. Like Kachuk no. hitting one game for the one spear and then one game for another spear, like within yeah. the same week is just not okay and then this I think needs to be like it's got to be 10 games yeah. you can't do it right I guess but I mean something that I always thought the league should have is that there, if there if there was ever a uh an actual assault on the ice like I don't know like I think back in what 80s 90s someone like speared a guy like slashed a guy over the head we yeah, have the, we ha- always have uh Todd Bertuzzi I feel as though if there's ever an incident like that again, I yeah. feel as though the the penalty should actually be you are out as long as he's out. Right, and that so because because like I mean, Todd Bertuzzi ended Steve Moore's career. Yeah, like, but that Bertuzzi was, was out for like that's a whole that's not even relatable to this event. But I'm, I know it's not. But I mean, going forward, if there's ever an incident like that again, but yeah, player safety just needs to. You know, be better in general. Yeah, especially with Peros just coming in, and this is like his first yeah. real attempt to give out a. I just think that it's not, yeah. not good. I think so. that there needs to be more consequences for that kind of play. There's no need for that kind of play. No, right? Really. It doesn't benefit the game at all. So what are no. you doing? No. 